going to stay gone. So everything I'm going to talk about is all about temperatures, and they're going to stay chilly. In fact, really, Sean, all month long, as we look here at the calendar for the month, it's been chilly. Every time you see blue, that means we've been below normal, which normal high this time of year is 72. We've got nine of them below normal. Only four days, as we're almost halfway through the month, only four days have been at or above. This kind of the exact opposite of what we had in March. Remember how warm March was? Not that we're complaining, pretty decent day. We've got a few clouds out there. Traffic looks good on 440 East and Westbound. And it is currently 64 degrees here in North Raleigh, like it is in most spots. Mid to low 60s, pretty much everywhere you go except Roanoke Rapids. You guys a little cooler at 56 degrees. We're all going to get chilly tonight. So it's the second night after the cold front. And this is the way it usually works. That's the coldest night. So it's not going to be 20s or 30s, but I don't want you to go out in shorts and short sleeves tomorrow. 58 degrees by 8 o'clock as we go hour by hour through tonight. We'll drop through the low 50s and then 40s. So after going outside this morning with 45, tomorrow it'll be 41 degrees. And we've got that for the next few mornings. So what's happened, the cold front, it pushed through and it took the clouds and rain with it, although they are just now to our south. If it weren't for this high pressure, we'd probably have a lot more clouds. But this high is going to keep a lot of that away. But it's also going to keep our winds coming out of the northeast. And that's why temperatures are going to stay below normal the next few days. So tomorrow's weather map doesn't look all that different than what we had today. Again, you drive a little bit to the south, you'll run into clouds and rain. And if things were different, I mean, that could nudge up here in our neck of the woods. But high pressure, holding firm, going to keep us sunny, breezy, and cool tomorrow. And again on Friday, not all that many changes as temperatures will hold in the 60s. You want changes? You got to wait till this weekend. That's when the area of high pressure will shift east. That cold front, clouds and rain really get out of here. And our winds come out of the south. So that's going to help warm us into the 60s. And before long, next week, we get back into the 70s. But not tomorrow. Tomorrow, very similar to today temperature-wise and wind-wise. It'll be a breezy day, no rain, plenty of sunshine. 64 here in Raleigh, 63 in Durham, 66 in Fayetteville. And your seven-day forecast will hold us in those 60s tomorrow, Friday, and Saturday. So each day, not going to feel that different than the other. Although winds will calm down Friday and Saturday. Notice our overnight lows, they stay in the low 40s. Then we warm up to 68 on Sunday. 76 on Monday, and we will stay in the 70s as we look at the rest of your seven-day forecast next Tuesday and Wednesday, and we keep rain out of the forecast until next Tuesday night into Wednesday, so Sean will have plenty of time to wash our cars. Or like me, wait Beer. until Tuesday when it rains <laughs> when and it have rains. it wash itself. That's what I